This video demonstrates the ease and speed with which cell count, size, viability and aggregation can be determined using a KC cell counter. We will now perform a measurement of HeLa cells. The instrument has already been set to measure these cells. We pipette 100 microliters of the sample and mix these 100 microliters with 10 milliliters of measurement buffer KC Tom. It is mixed simply by rotating the sample three times. This is sufficient to ensure thorough mixing. The sample is then placed on the sample base and the measurement is started. To obtain sufficient statistical certainty, we carry out a triple measurement, which takes about 30 seconds. For each measurement cycle, 400 microliters of sample are drawn into a measuring capillary. After the first measurement, preliminary results and a provisional size distribution are visualized on the screen. After the last measurement, the final result is displayed, including the standard deviation. After optional input of comments, the results are stored and measuring is completed. In the graphical output, a typical size distribution is clearly visible, consisting of cell debris, dead cells, viable cells, and cell aggregates. As numerical results, we first get the total number of measured events. In this case, 5,879, with a standard deviation, which as you can see here, is very good, plus minus 0.6%. From these results, the vital cell number is calculated to be 6.26 times 10 to the power of 5. This equals a vitality of 86.3% and an aggregation factor of 1.214. In addition, we also obtain the diameter and volume results for the cells. Here, the typical mean diameter for the HeLa cell is 18.87 microns. One simple measurement provides cell count, viability, live-dead ratio, and cell aggregation. Casey, reliable cell counts in seconds, die-free. Full quality control of your cells with lifetime calibration.